most memorable backstage fight? Coco Ware and Steve Kern. You know who Steve Kern was? Uh, one of the fabulous ones. Yes, and mm -hmm. uh, and Coco Beware. Uh, the uh, uh, yeah, the parrot, the me, parrot fellow. I, lo I love both of them, and I'm not here to knock. I don't th want you to think that I'm being bad. Uh I uh, I have somebody knocking at my door. I'm gonna go see who it is. Okay, okay I'll be here. Kerry James. Okay. I'm back. He's with them. Kerry answered the door. I'm sorry. Uh, now, uh, what I'm telling you, Steve and Coco, they were both my friends, and I loved both of them. But at that time and age, you're in territories where you're trying to get over, and uh, and they did a thing. And to me, I think Steve was wrong because uh, everybody did the strut. Jackie Fargo did the strut. And Coco was a heel. I mean, uh, and that, and see, on that Saturday morning, Coco did the strut on TV. And uh, Steve and Stan were supposed to have been in Jonesboro. But they, they didn't go to their town. And they went to Nashville, where Coco was at. And they come right in the dressing room. And uh, Coco just wrestled. Coco was in the sh one of them little bitty showers. You understand me? So he went to take a shower. Steve Kern went and sucker punched him. Yeah, worst mistake he ever made. Coco Ware come out of that shower butt naked and beat his ass. I mean, really beat his ass. Uh, talking to him, cutting interviews on him, whooping his ass, you know. And then he had, you know, stopped. And then he'll whoop his ass again, <laughs> you know. But I, I'm serious. I'm not saying that bad about Steve Burn. But there's some things in life that you can do and can do. Uh, especially, you, you know, you don't mess with, you know, with some people you don't mess with. You know, Coco was real short and little and all that. But, dude, he was like a fire plug, man. He had blow you off your feet <laughs> well, i've i've never heard that one i've heard the one with him and um, a guy called jim troy over in europe he was an old hockey guy but is coco beware just like on the on the download a proper tough oh guy. no 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 uh you ever talked to dutch mantel no i'd love to but no yeah uh the dutch was in there and my dad was alive then he was a referee look here my dad walked in the dressing room is it nashville tennessee and uh, he walked right in the dressing room, and they was fighting. And my daddy turned around, locked the door, <laughs> and uh, he, he sat out right beside me. And Steve and me, him and Dutch, and uh, Robert was sat there. Oh yeah, and I mean, Coca. I mean, it's you know that wasn't Steve's night that night. Hmm. <laughs> okay, so, uh, but you know what I and, and, and as big as me, I never had no trouble with really any of the boys. You know, I, 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 I didn't have to. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I, and one good thing is when, when it was territories like that, I was the top baby face. And uh, we depended on each other to make money. So didn't nobody mess with you because they'd get fired. <laughs> you know, but it wasn't that. But it's a lot of different things. Yeah.